Now Allen out of the backfield goes in motion. Ohio brings pressure. He's Gaston wide open inside the five. Touchdown. Well, it's been almost a year since Aronde Gatson has played football for his first catch. He makes it. He, did. he originally gave it to the linesman and said, that's not going to work. That's not the right guy. Ten seconds. Maybe one shot to the end zone here from McCord. And he takes it. Has a receiver open in the corner. Pena for the score. The football that we've witnessed has been a full team effort by the Orange. First and goal on the three-yard line for Ohio. The defense stands up. Ronde Gatson down the bottom of your screen. McCord goes to LaQuinn. Allen one-handed catch for the touchdown. What a luxury. Kyle McCord gets two top targets on the right-hand side. Ronde Gatson clears out. And LaQuinn. McCord, the fake to Willis. Going to the corner for Pena. Touchdown. Great placement of the football. Back shoulder away from the defender. Pena in motion. They'll go his way toward the goal line. Reaches over. Touchdown. And if this one stands, which I think it will, he'll have had his third. Pressure again, got the linebackers up in the line of scrimmage. They'll bring just four. McCord looking downfield. Over the middle has Pena, and they connect. McCord to throw, looking to the end zone. Over the top, Pena has got another one. And it's just another time where, you know, pretty good job passing off, but this the pick creates separation. Ronde Gatson on the linebacker in the middle of the field. And they get Georgia Tech to jump. Free play, and it's a touchdown. That's, I mean, you'd see that from a mile away. You break the formation, and Ronde Gatson is being covered. One on one by Kyle Eford. That is a touchdown all day. Run stopping linebacker on the best tight end in the ACC. I know exactly where I'm going. Looks him off a tiny bit. In for six. Record to throw. Has a pocket, has a receiver. Touchdown. Mentioned LaQuinn Allen, Mark. They're pretty happy he stayed. They're pretty happy this young man stayed as well. Target for Syracuse, one of the best tight ends in the nation. And he has come back with a vengeance this year. Four. Four defenders around him. And with that height and length, Kyle McCourt still able to deliver the. Again, McCourt flushed to his right. Mr. Hatcher. I mean, nice job on the back end. There are three tight ends in the game. Now Gatson goes wide. Fake to Allen. McCord ducks away. He'll try to run for it. McCord catapults. Syracuse can take the lead with the PAT. It leaves right outside. Look at all the room inside when they decide to go. 
Fake the handoff. McCord the pump fake. Launches deep down the sideline into double coverage. And it's pulled in by Amari Hatcher. Can the Holy Cross defense get a stand and force three instead of six? McCord under duress. Flushed out to the left. Fires on the run to Hatcher. Touchdown Syracuse. We see McCord, initially a good pocket. He has to break out. He's not a dual threat quarterback, but he certainly has the athleticism. Call to chip, call whatever you want. He's just playing with a lot of motivation this season after missing last year. Get in the end zone. Touchdown, Syracuse. With the safety coming over the top, he's able to step into that throw and put it right on his receiver. Nice little adjustment there. 163 yards, two touchdowns. Syracuse ran 28 plays in the first quarter to just nine for Holy Cross. McCord wants it all down the sideline to Meeks. Touchdown, Syracuse. 38 yards. Barely took him a quarter to get there today. He's got Jackson Meeks to the outside. A little bit of a stutter step, gets that corner to stop his feet, works to the outside. Safety not able to get over there. Just another beautiful throw by a Kyle McCord. And you see there, it all starts. Excellent protection up front. Beautifully executed play there for Syracuse from beginning to end, from the protection to the throw to the route, resulting in another touchdown. You know, the thing with Meeks, too, is he initially came out and signed with Georgia, and it's easy to kind of get lost on that roster. Kirby Smart, since he's been the head coach of Georgia, has never signed a class. 36 seconds and two timeouts for Syracuse. There's a lot of time here to do whatever they want to do. Playbook is wide open. Flings it to the sideline. Caught by Pena. Touchdown, Orange. I think important on this drive, too. I think the momentum turner was that punt. It's your new TV guy. Man, it's fun. Here is a play fake by McCord. Pressure coming. Taking the deep shot downfield. And it is caught. Touchdown for the Orange. I believe, yes, touchdown. Mari Hatcher. Yep. Well, this is just no safety help. One-on-one. -on -one. You see the ESPN analytics say on fourth and eight or less, it's a go. And that's what Fran Brown is doing. Here's McCord looking again. End zone throw. He's caught. Down for Jackson Meeks. A step into the end zone. Anywhere else, mm. it's an incomplete pass. Credit Kyle McCord. He wanted to go left, comes back, resets his feet, and just throws an absolute dart to McCord. And Syracuse gets on the board. Eighteen plays, seventy three yards, nine minutes, thirty eight seconds.